Hello, my name is Kevin Miller. Welcome to another episode of Weightlifting with Arthritis. Uh, today we're going to be going over push-ups. Um, there are about a hundred different ways to do push-ups. We're going to be going over about three different kinds uh, for when your arthritis isn't bothering you uh, and when it's and when it is bothering you. Um, we just I'll demonstrate just for I don't know those who may not know how to do a basic push-up. You know. Is to get your back flat, arm shoulder width apart, head up, down, and up, down, and up. Basic push up, that's all. Um, but now, what you really need to know is how to do push ups when your arthritis is bothering you. Um, maybe you can't get on the ground because your knees are really bad that day, or maybe just the, the weight on your elbows is too much for that day. So, what you do is you're going to do push ups on the wall. And all you do is you stand, depending on your height, about three feet from the wall. Keep your feet, your heels together, feet uh, apart a little bit. And you're gonna put your shoulder, your hands, shoulder width, shoulder height on the wall, fingers spread. Spread your fingers out so it disperses the, uh, the pressure on your hands. And you're just gonna go down slowly and then back up. Like you're touching your nose up against the wall. And that's it. And uh, if that's too much, if you can't do this, that's too much for whatever reason, you can just go halfway and back up. And if it's, it's just and the repeated motion, you don't even have to do repetitions. If the repeated motion is too much, then just go down and hold it. And that way you cut down on the repetitions on your, on your elbows and then go back up. And that's it. And the key is that might seem too easy, but on a day when your arthritis is real bad, then that'll help you to get some exercise in while your arthritis is bad. Because arthritis is gonna try to tell you it's not to do anything, to sit down, take it easy. But you know, if you've lived with it with it for any time, you know you have to keep moving to make you feel better. Um, so last, uh, another way to do push-ups I'm gonna show you is called a dive bomber. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna be making a sweeping motion with your chest against the ground, like a, like a plane with a dive bomb. Um, so, what you're gonna do is you're gonna start, the starting position is the position normally, you know, you see other people do when they're tired of push-ups. You know, once you're tired, you're doing push-ups and you get tired, do you do this to rest? Well, that's your starting position. You're gonna start like this, your heels are gonna be down, and as you, as you do the motion, your heels are gonna, you're gonna come down on your tippy toes. Start off like this, and you're gonna sweep the ground. Get on your toes, straighten out that tricep, and back, Back to your heels are, are almost flat. And then back again. Sweep the ground, straighten out your triceps on your tippy toes, and back down. And that's it. <clears throat> and that is a much better, much harder way to do push ups. Um, I just want to give you one last tip. Um, uh, on a day maybe you want to focus on triceps, but you're tired of the same old, same old. <clears throat> this is a. a a modified dive bomber to only work your triceps. It really just focuses all, of, all the attention on the tricep. And this starting position is gonna be your hands down here, like about uh, where, your, where your shoulders are. And you're gonna be trying to keep your heels as flat as you can. And again, just like before, you're gonna be coming up on your tippy toes. So basically you're just doing the second half of the dive bomber. So, Heels flat, you're gonna be hands where your shoulders should be, and extend and go like extend your tricep while you can get on your tippy toes. And then back down. And back up, extend that tricep, back down. And when you're down, your chest is gonna be, your hands, your shoulders, and your chest are all gonna be in line. <clears throat> One last time. Heels flat, chest in line with your shoulders and your hands, and extend your triceps and get on your tippy toes. And that's it. Ugh. And that's all. You can see that's, pretty, that's a pretty good exercise. It's pretty tough. Um, that's it for today. I hope you, uh, this helped you. Hope you learned something. Um, anything else you might want to see in the future video, comment, let me know, and I'm here to help. Thanks a lot. See you next time.